All right, folks. This is Hermes Gambit. And welcome back to our Skyrim weekend stream. Holy crap, I did not know. So that's what happens to a Charus. Ew. Gross. Yeah, anyway. We went on an undercover drug bust at this red water den. I can't believe it. I just walked in so the vampires were making like an addictive skooma. That way they have a steady supply of food. But you know, I, I'm taking care of that right now. No, it's kind of strange, isn't it? I remember reading about this place in an article, and now I'm here. I wasn't even looking for it. I'm serious. All right. Yeah, that chest over there is going to be annoying. How do I reach it? I don't think I can. Mm -hmm. It's a terrible sort of affair. That that treasure chest is right over there. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna have to give it up. Do 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 do. There's a body down there, but I can't even... Oh, hey, Demonic, what's up? <laughs> How are you doing this weekend? Thanks for the ride. So, yeah, I was heading to Rufton, and... I came across this weird, weird place. <laughs> ah, how did it go? This red water den. Ah, man, what the hell? Yeah. That's no good. Huh, I wonder why though. No, think about it. It's interesting, isn't it? Sony's gonna put out more PS4s, but Microsoft is gonna stop making any more Xbox Ones. <laughs> Emma Watson. Yeah. She has all the rage these days. There we go. I need to see. Yeah, so it looks like the previous one disappears. Yeah, take that, take that. I wonder if any more vampires are still here. Ah, I got you. Oh. Hmm. What you in the mood for? A little sack of gold. I'll take it. Huh. 
Oh, this must be the other way from earlier. Yep. Hey, hey. Yep, it sure is. Yeah, and I see my arrow there. Check the map. Ah, I got you. Any of your comrades around? Fold out. I gotcha. Well, never hurts to see if anybody's up for something. Man, how long is this damn cave? This is supposed to be a simple Miami Vice bus, and this thing just keeps going. You know what? Let me be a little extra stealthy. Yeah, I just saw some people just hanging out and say, hey man, you can come in here if you want to. Like the lady at the counter is like, here's a free bottle. And I tried it, and I woke up and there were some vampires around there. So this has become Dragonborn Miami Vice. <laughs> Which was kind of easy. I just resurrected one of the vampires and he kind of killed half the cave. <laughs> that was great. Uh, what was that? I felt the ear change a second. Now, what the heck is this? Yes, it hurts me. What is brain rot? <laughs> Holy God. Ah. Uh. Oh, okay. Hmm, so this is connected to the Dawn God DLC. What the hell is brain rot? Damn, I should have packed more of these. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, there is a bunch of hailhounds here. Holy crap. <laughs> Holy crap. Let me see, how are we going to handle this? First, let me get a weapon. In case they just shrug off all my... Oof. Man, I like how quiet and stealthy they are. I hate these damn things. <laughs> You know, this would be a perfect time. Let's try out our undying ghost. Thanks, man. Undying ghost, bro. <laughs> hmm. Does someone live? Um. 
the dead. Holy crap, what is that, Master Vampire? Help your homie! <laughs> Oh man, he is just tearing me up. Well, it's perfect because I need to get rid of some stuff. Gotcha! That's right. Don't let him do you like that. <laughs> Good job. Good job, my undead servants. <laughs> Ooh, vampire fledgling. Gotta go berserk dust. This was a master vampire. I mean, hell, huh? You know what? Take these collars. They are too heavy for me. Huh, you know, do you really do anything with Death Hound collars? I'm wondering about that. Dang, what happened to. Ah, oh, here we go. Ah, uh, lame. You didn't have anything on you. Got all these damn things for brain rot around here. Hmm. I guess you were right. Yeah, I did see a lot of coffins around here. You can have to die that hard, man. Hoo -ah. The Al Pacino desk. Hoo -ah. oh, I don't want to make anything. It'd be too heavy anyway. Okay, and do another quick save because. So I must have killed the rest when I was just making my way out of here. You know, just walking the whole damn circle. <laughs> Nah, I don't want to contract anything. I'm not going to sleep in any coffin. It's tempting, though. I'm sure it looks comfy. Hmm. I wonder if you get your own coffin if you go to Vampire Mountain. I mean, do you get to bring it in your house or something? One more save, because I don't trust the universe. And... Ha. See what we got in here. Eh. It's kind of weird. I was reading an article about this, and now I'm here. I was not even looking for this place. If you want a real adventure, go to the Red Water Den. Like, man, I'll probably find that place eventually. <laughs> Let's see, check here. Got gold. Hmm. Bones. Ah! More gold. Okay, let's go through wooden door number two.
Whoa! Ah! God dang it! Oh! Okay, the traps are getting a little bit more inventive. How delightful! All these damn doors. <laughs> One more time. See how far does this place go? Ah! Ah! <laughs> Why? that yeah yeah I'm gonna have to do this by myself cuz whatever I summon we're gonna step all this junk hmm I wonder if all of yeah the vampires must have cleared out all the drugger cuz I did come across a few bodies Wow Whoa, what's up in here? It's like a whole chamber room. It was me. Ooh, that's a nice build. Let's try that one. That did not work. Get him! Get him! <laughs> oh. oh, yeah! Boom! Ah, oh, they killed my beer! <laughs> no! He was innocent. Oh. I almost forgot. We got ourselves a new ebony spell. Ebony flesh. I have the power. I can't fight. <laughs> you know what? Let's see, so strangulations apprentice. I need a good old touch of death. Oh god! And I felt the death, no! <laughs> Tough, so alright. Okay, that ain't too bad. Oh, come on, I gotta look through all this stuff again. Damn. But hindsight's 20 20. That means we won't get stabbed by the spikes again. Yeah, and I missed something. Draw to that reserve. Regeneration. There's so much damn vampires down here. I'm gonna have to come back here again once I start that dog guard thing. Well, I don't think I'm joining the vampires. That's it's not the life I want. <laughs> I like being out in the sun, <laughs> fighting me enemies and whatnot. Let's see, get this right. Ha <laughs> ha! Nice try. That's right. It was weird. It should have brought me back here. Not back here, but a little bit further up. Hmm. Okay. Is 
Nope. Ah, not this time. Man, if I didn't have that anti-magic stone thing, this would be really bad. <laughs> Let's think about our magic before we go in there. Give me the ebony flesh. And hmm. Who we summoning? They just shoved my beer out the way like it was nothing. Foul zombie? Uh, we can come out drum more, Lord. Hmm. Really, it doesn't cost me a thing to summon this. I wasn't paying attention to them. But I think I'll summon a drum Lord. Oh yeah, incinerate's more cheaper for me now, so I actually can use that. Here I am! Gonna rock ya, like a hurricane. Alright, come on, summon it! Summon it, summon it, summon it, summon it! <laughs> you know what? Give me... Hmm... Yeah, what do I want? Take a look. You know what? Give me a lightning cloak. Woo! Get him! Get him! <laughs> Don't you be hurting my homie. Touch of death! Touch of death! My homie! No! I need to give me more magicka. Double more magicka. There we go. Can I switch mass now? Ah, oh, come on! Really? Really? That's still too much waiting. Alright, I'm dying, ghost. Take it from here. Among the dead. Whoa! Kick us what? Kick her what? What the hell? No more! I yield! I yield! Ah! I didn't do anything to you, man! <laughs> Where are you? Where are you? Thanks, buddy. Where are you? Where are you? So who is this? Venerius Vulpin. Ooh. Hmm. What's mine? My Nordic is about 27. Hmm. Yeah, you know what? I can bump this up a little bit more. I'll take it. I shouldn't have taken it. It's wearing me down. Like most things in life. Yep. Oh, this sucks. <laughs> No 
what I need to see. And I'm sure everybody else needs to see. Let me see. Where is... Uh, in my age light. Thanks, dear guy. You really came out the clutch today. Alright, so let's see what these guys are up to here. Yep. Oh, I'll be taking that skooma. Bloody rags. Hmm. How big are they gonna be? <laughs> oh, come on, man. Oh, ah, it's cool armor. I'm gonna have to take it. Oh, we got a journal. I'll take that, take that, take that, take that, and I'm going to have to give this up. See, oh, yeah, I'll give up the pickaxe. Take it. I can find a pickaxe anywhere. Not my cooked beef. I'll eat one of my carps. I'll eat a few of my wedges of cheese. Alright, we can move again. Hmm. Ordinary mod plus the Volcrim and the Adamant. Change the skill trees and someone made a mod patch for the north. Huh, oh, okay. I mean, you can never have enough power. Especially here, I'm liking these new spells I got. Huh. I thought the game was supposed to spaz out if there was too much golden gems in like one part. Damn it. Alright, drop the ball. Cause yeah, I remember some folks saying that I think there's one guy he was collecting all the gems and I think he stared at it or something and his game crash. Hmm. Okay, so we get to read the second entry. Thanks to the more sordid past of some of my underlings, we found a way to add the waters of the blood spring into the process of turning moon sugar to skooma. Far more potent and highly addictive, we turned the basement into a den and sent out some of the locals with samples to lure people back turning the disappointment of spring into a ready supply of blood. We're calling it Red Water Skooma, in case any of the patrons happen to notice water in any of the corners. I found many ruined books in the chambers connected to the spring and will continue to study them for a way to drink the waters without the side effects. Mortals appear to become infected with all manner of disease while vampires gain power but only for a short while. Many of the books I've found are but tattered shreds ruined by the ages and moisture, but I've pieced together the origin of the spring of little else. It used to be a spring sacred to R.K. in the first era, headed by the priest Linegar. I'm glossing over much that isn't of interest to in my search, but it would seem that the woman he was in love with was bitten and turned into a vampire, and subsequently turned him as well. Wow, damn! They went on a rampage through the spring and killed the other priests as they cowered in the pool praying for Arcade's protection. And as we tore the spine, the last priestess took the viscera into the blood stone chalice. Water ran red forevermore. Hmm, perhaps this bloodstone chalice is the answer. Whoa! That looks cool! Holy crap! Weeks of research and still nothing to show for it. It would seem that the bloodstone chalice most likely the key to harnessing the power of the spring. 
but it's also clear that at some point it was removed from the ruins. Found an illustration of which I have endeavored to sketch here, but nothing else regarding where it may have ended up. Hmm. Curious. Man, that's a nice picture though. <laughs> I want it. You guys are the worst vampires ever. You don't even leave gold inside your coffins. What's up here? Nothing. Nothing. Why would you do this to me? Yeah. So, this was Venerous Vulpin. Hmm. Alright. <laughs> let us quick save. And let us go. Whoa, that looks kind of extra funky. <laughs> ah, Wabba Jack, Wabba Jack, Wabba Jack. <laughs> you know, I carry that staff with me, but I'm afraid it'd make things worse. <laughs> hmm. Well, fingers crossed that everything works out and no crashes. Let me save before I jump into this. So it causes all manner. What? Ah, ah, lame. I've contracted things. Holy crap. Auto save. Wow, you saved for this, huh? Wow. Brain rot and. <laughs> no, I don't want to be one. Progress to vampirism. Anyway, I'm going back to carrying like six bottles of these things because. Dang! Get rid of all that junk. I don't want it. What if I stand in it? So, vampires, they get a little strength for a short time. Us, we get a chance to turn into vampires. How... How terrifying. This place needs to be destroyed. <laughs> okay, so if I ever get tired of this human half-elf life, well, Dark Elf Life, I can just drink out this fountain. Especially after watching that Demon Slayer movie. I must value my mortality. Yeah, I was finally able to watch that Mugen Train Demon Slayer movie and it bummed me out. I thought it was going to be a whimsical train adventure with the homies. It wasn't.
Man, they beat up all the drug and just took over this place, huh? Quick save. I don't trust the universe. Sure, I ain't got no diseases. No, I won't bring anything back to the kids. This is the cellar. So everything is mine now. No, uh, uh, yeah, you might as well take this flower. Well, I shouldn't. Bring apple for the kids. Cabbages. Ah! Man, is it stealing if it's mine? Empty skooma bottles. Whoa! I'm taking that. And she was ready to kill anybody if they were going crazy in here. Hmm. All these ones are empty. I ain't taking any more ale on me. I don't want to be heavy. Oh man, did they kill y'all? Yeah, really. Yeah, they killed you and took your clothes. Well, dang. Empty skooma bottles. Imperial deserter. Hmm. Yeah, I need to add it to my armor collection. Sorry, buddy. Uh, I'm so heavy. Dance and fire. I'll take the healing. I'll take the gold ring. I take everything. <laughs> Go that sets undead up to level 45. Ooh, I'm taking it, but I ain't gonna use it. Uh. Uh. Okay, so yeah. They took me from there, they locked me up here, and I had my whole adventure down there. Uh, that's it for the drug den. Now to make my great escape. As fast as I can. Uh, 
as fast as I can. Wait, what was in this room? Oh, these were the. This was the bathroom. Fine. Let me see. What, what we got? Come on, I gotta have something for the kids. I got dragon bones on me, really? I didn't dump those off? Uh, that explains so much. Dang, I never run out of lockpicks though, I got like 354. I'm gonna have to drop this on, I. That's fine. Did I check this guy? Yeah, I did. Noble man. Alright, and we're out. Yeah? So... You know what? It's gonna end up with me killing all these people around here anyway. I I might as well go to f full course because I came here. What do you want? Yes. Need something? Yeah, I'm gonna rob you in a sec. <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> Let me prepare for this. Hmm, you know they did say in that article when I mean, you could come in here and guns are blazing. Thunderbolt or hit you with the Palpatine. Speak, elf. Or what? You know what? <laughs> yeah. You are a vampire throw, and I've killed a bunch of you already. Enough. <laughs> I came here thinking this was going to be a good time, and it wasn't. But you know what? I got on after that. See you later. Dark seducers are a dangerous race of warriors from the dumb. Shagrath's realm, I was with the Golden Saints and Capi for. We're gonna see her. Oh, yeah, we gotta still do that quest, don't we? Need something? Yeah. something yes y'all know everybody's dead down there right um you know what mm -hmm. maybe the killing will stop right here they are just thralls right thralls are still kind of human mm -hmm. Then let's hit home.
Dang, we got a long way to go to Ruffton. <laughs> Yeah, let me head home. I got too much stuff on me. And I need to get the Staff of Mages. We accidentally started one of those requests. <laughs> Frostbite Spiders want Skyrim's most fair summon most. Poison and fangs. Ah, it's good to be home. Something landed around here. I'm pretty sure it was a dragon. Ah, this is my home, you asshole. A place where there shouldn't be any of you guys. That's the first one that's ever been around here. Let's see if we Hmm. You come down here and face me. Oh, it's one of the ancient bad boys, huh? Prepared for trouble, but not like this. I've got bone breaker fever. <laughs> Man, you got deal all this. You just got home. Really? I got back breaker fever. I'm gonna have to buy more of these, aren't I? Well, unless I can make them. I guess I should have enough greens for that. Touch it there. Touch it there. <laughs> You. Well, I can't blame the kids for not wanting to go outside. Crap, I'm outside of Forsworn then. Oh. 
Oh. Oh, I was busy doing that. No, screw it. Give me my other mask. Okay, thanks for murdering my neighbors, but I've seen it. <laughs> Force Warren up in another fight. Whoa! Woo! Oh, he's about to eat me. Didn't want to finish me with your breath, so you just chewed me like a rag doll. I see how it is. Hmm. Okay. We're gonna try a little something. If an ancient dragon showed up there... Let's head to my usual spot near White Run. You fell for it, my dragon friend. You will pay for murdering me outside my home. Okay, then. I'm trying to get all these butterflies. Oh, 
Okay. I grabbed a butterfly. How is that heavy? Screw it as I'm going home. That asshole better not follow me again. I'm sure he's among the most You're home. Did you get me a present? Oh. Yes, I did. Wow, really? <laughs> what do you get me? <laughs> Here's an apple. <laughs> Thanks. Lucy, get back in the house. It's kind of dangerous out here. <laughs> yeah, kids. Now let's put up our junk. Let's see what I got. Because what's really wearing us down is what is it? These dragon bones, the bones. All right. Take this off now. There we go. Let's make some jewelry. Hmm. Okay, sapphire rings 500. Still got iron for now. Alright. On the head to my house. It's out near the forsworn, my house. Do 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 bow down. Why does this pot always fall down when I get in here? Hey kids, how's you going? Hey Pa! Hmm? Wow, really? What'd you get me? I got you an apple. Thanks. Papa. Hmm? Stay safe. Thanks. Yes. Stay safe. Thanks, kids. Sometimes. Like the tree in the park is so pretty. Um, you know we're not in winter. All right. Well, I suppose you can call some of the stuff tree in the park. The soul's growing brighter for a second. All right. I can finally give you the ebony armor. There you go.
Damn. I didn't have any Ebony God? That's, I thought I did. Gilded armor. That's sixty-six. Hmm. Oh, okay. Yeah. Slightly magical. Whoop. Okay, give, give, give. Nice. Just need your helmet. You need your arms. <laughs> Everything's starting to slowly come together. Alright, I'm gonna need to take my staff of mages with me. We'll do a swap later, cuz. I kinda prefer that over the mage staff. What's that blue one? Magicka Recovery Boy. Come on, I don't have Q. Uh, yeah, I do. I just need. Damn, I need another ingredient for this. Well, you know. Perhaps we can test that out. Let's see what we got here. This gives me a time to empty out my ingredients in the most horrible way. Ooh. Oh no, fire sauce are too valuable. Is he? Yeah. So for all sons. Ew. shouldn't have eaten that. Is it juniper berry or grass juniper berry? Ah, whatever. I'm not trying that. Moon sugar. Ew. So purple regenerates health, okay. I might be dead after this. <laughs> Oh, 
Wow. I'm not doing that. Ah. <laughs> I can taste the cosmos. I have weakness to shock, weakness to poisons, weakness to magic, weakness to magic, weakness to magic, weakness to frost, weakness to frost, weakness to frost, weakness to fire, weakness to fire. Moon sugar does that? Yeah. That's just awful. Damn, I was hoping to make cure disease. What else do I need? Yeah. Yeah, I need another ingredient for that. Hmm. Well, let's use the account chat. To... Hmm. Nope, that's not happening. But at least we weaken ourselves down a bit. That's my book one. Wardrobe. Alright. Hmm. You know? What the heck was that? Yeah, you kids went to sleep early. It is only nine o'clock. Hmm. What's going on the back part? Here. Hmm. Oh, no wonder. Let's see, what? these from hmm. yeah I'll give you the backpack and you can have these other dragon boots Man, I got all sorts of desserts in here. This is nice. Oh man, we can have all sorts of stuff. Let's see. Let's make a lavender dumpling. Oh, I wanted to make other stuff. Uh, we can, we can have some baked potatoes. <laughs> Another baked potato. Got us a little up. We can have some crab cakes and some other stuff. Okay, so we need a sack of flour. Wait. Do I have flour? Oh, yeah. Oh, well, let's make us some crab cakes. Okay, let me see. I'm going to do a braided bread first. No, I kind of like those. Especially when they got like a little bit of sugar on them. Good. Alright, we made some braided bread and... Yeah, I'm probably going to have to steal some more ingredients. It's going to be a priority now. <laughs> have us some crab cakes. What I need for a jazz bay crostata, juniper berry crostata, 
strawberry crostata. We need butter. But we need to ask the more important question. Will them press Chef Ramsay's? We are not doing poisoned apples. <laughs> I don't even know why that's an option, really. Why? Why? Uh, let's take a seat. Ooh. Man, I love my house. Anyway, guys, I think that's gonna be it. We'll be back tomorrow with Tales of a Rise. <laughs> anyway, this is Hermit's Gambit. And as always, thanks for stopping by. And I will catch y'all later. Have a good week, folks. <laughs>